Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Nikki Styles Her Curves. I am Nikki, and today we're going to be starting a brand new vlog. This is just going to be a few days in my life because we have lots of things going on, and I'm going to share them with you guys. If this is your first time watching my channel, I focus mainly on curvy girl fashion, lifestyle, beauty, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So this falls into a little bit of that. Um, so come along with me, guys, as we just spend a few days together doing a bunch of things. So we're actually going to recap from yesterday because I didn't start the vlog yesterday, but yesterday was my son's middle school graduation. Um, so he graduated from the eighth grade. So let me go ahead and shoot over to that. Hello. Can I be in the picture? Tyler Thomas. Let's go, baby! <laughs> Is Julie, are you gonna make like a toast, a cheers? <laughs> Julie, say something. Okay. So Matthew, may all your wishes come true. This is just the beginning, and you have a bright, bright future ahead of you. Yeah. Cheers. So today, some of my family that's in town from out of state, they're staying at an Airbnb that's nearby. It's a waterfront property. So we're just kind of gonna chill, have some wine. I think we're gonna make some s'mores, eat some food and catch a vibe. So let's get into it. Shorty got that body out of No time, up, you my Stand on my side. And you better choose wisely. Oh, those little things on mm -hmm. the shelf? You put the boiled, the hard boiled eggs in there. Wow, look at that. You know? Oh, let's turn it on so you can see it. <laughs> you ever seen a chandelier slash sconce in a in a no. shower? <laughs> so we've been here for some time now. We just um like had some drinks. We had some food. Uh, we were going to make s'mores, but we forgot the sticks for the marshmallows. Um, so I think we're probably gonna come back here on Saturday and barbecue again. So we'll make sure we have all the sticks and the good stuff for that. It's a Thursday and your girl has to work from home tomorrow. So I think we're going to head out. Isn't this bathroom so cute? I love a little antique moment. We're in Connecticut. So I wasn't expecting for the Airbnb to be all like updated. This is a very cute vintage type of home. The outside is beautiful. So I already took like some pictures. You know, we got to get the content in. And I think that we're going to end it for tonight here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, guys. So it is raining and pouring outside. So we kept it very casual today. We just got into Primark. And I'm just wearing this black dress, which is kind of like a Skims dupe. I think it's from Shein. I have on this little denim overcoat, which is from Fashion Nova. I have a scarf on my head because the rain is torrential. And then I just have on these sandals, which are from Torrid. I already started picking up a couple of items, so let's keep shopping. So many colorful accessories. I might need this green hat. I think this is like a sleep corset, but who can sleep in the corset on? This is cute though. And this looks like a real dress. These pajamas, this little sleepwear section? 
It's giving. Hey guys, so today is the next day. So if you remember, we went to a house a couple days ago and I said we're probably gonna go back on Saturday. So today is Saturday. So we're going back for a barbecue. This one is gonna be bigger. It's gonna be a lot of family in town from all different places. Yesterday we went to Primark. I'll be sure to show you guys the items that I picked up from Primark. It was just a couple of things just because right now I'm more on of a declutter mode than a shopping mode but um let me show you guys my okay, outfit so my dress is from rev dolls it is a tie dye maxi dress these um shoes are from asos my bag is from coach my earrings are zara and now let's hit the road <laughs> Happy Father's Day to all of the dads out there. Since it's Father's Day, I am with my husband, just celebrating him and giving him all of the flowers. So we always spend Father's Day all together as a family. But since all of my family are in town, they're actually going to take the boys go-karting into the movies. And I had already planned an overnight trip to New Jersey for my husband and kids. So it's just me and my husband. So um, for if it was like Mother's Day, I would like to be going to like brunch, dressing up, going shopping, but it's Father's Day. So we're gonna do what my husband wants to do and he actually just wants to go to the movies. Um, we've never been to a dine-in theater before, so we're gonna do that for the first time. Um, so we're gonna go see The Blackening, which is a comedy. So I'm just very casually dressed. I just have on this plaid shirt which is from Shein. I have on a two-piece set which is also from Shein and then I have this bag which I actually got when we went to Primark earlier this week. So um, I would like to go shopping but we're in New Jersey and a lot of the malls are closed on Sundays. So it's, I don't think it's going to be shopping. Maybe tomorrow. Um, but we're going to go to the movies and I'm just going to make sure that my husband has a great day because he deserves it he really like does his thing he's a great dad he's a great husband and i just want to make sure he feels like a king so let's go to the movies <laughs> actually pretty funny like I'm not gonna lie it was dead funny like if you like scary movie or any of those like spoof kind of movies that are like kind of scary and funny and it has black people in it then you will enjoy the movie I really enjoyed it even though I didn't think I was gonna enjoy it I guess I didn't really watch the previews like that so I wasn't sure how I was gonna feel about it but anyways it was a good movie um, after we went to the movies, we kind of ended up just chilling because, like, my husband wasn't really interested in, like, going out to eat or anything like that, although it was offered. So we kind of just ended up coming back, grabbing some food. I got some coffee, and then we just chilled. 
So it's the next day, it's time to check out. It's not really time to check out, but it's almost time to check out. So as you can see, my hair and makeup is done because I want to get some content. So we're going to go over to American Dream Mall. Um, if you've never been there before, the decor in there is very, very nice. Obviously there's stores and all that good stuff. So we're definitely going to just get some content, take some pictures, and then we'll probably do some shopping around the mall. But whatever we do, I'll take you guys with me. So let's see how it goes. with a friend today is her son's first birthday and we haven't seen her in a while so we're gonna have lunch my cousin is her best friend and she's actually here to surprise her there's my baby I don't know if you saw him um, but we're just gonna have lunch some drinks chill so let's go see what the restaurant is giving restaurant on the screen I had the gyro or gyro however you want to pronounce it um, and now we're actually heading off to um, a bakery we're going to a local bakery the name of it is Martha's Country Bakery I think um, it's my friend's son's first birthday so we want to make sure that he gets like a cupcake and we're all gonna get some treats so let's see what they have going on there and when I wake up I recognize you looking money for the pay cut but how much right and when I wake up I recognize you looking money for the pay cut but how much right and when I wake up I recognize you looking money for the pay cut today is Thursday and today we are actually in a brand new restaurant in Hartford the name of it is raw it's a seafood restaurant so this is my first time trying it I figured I would take you guys with me so you can see it but it's definitely one of those restaurants that has like a lot of just like aesthetically pleasing things to see I actually don't eat seafood but I want to come here just for some drinks and maybe I'll find something on the menu that appeals to me my dress is from Rev dolls and then um, my bag is from H&M the color theme in here as you can hopefully see it's kind of like white silver and tiffany blue so i wanted to just match the aesthetic but let's see what the restaurant's giving cousin and my aunt they just want to grab the car because these shoes are giving no ma'am to the walking the food was good 
Um, I only had french fries because I don't really eat seafood, but they enjoyed their food. I enjoyed my drink. And it's time to head home. This is the next day, so today is Friday. We're actually gonna close out the vlog here. That was a week in my life because I think we started on a Thursday and then we'll end it for last night. We're so we're actually going to be starting a new vlog because I was invited to a weekend content creator, influencer, whatever you wanna call it, a weekend little getaway up in Massachusetts. As you guys know, I live in Connecticut, so Massachusetts is right there, but we have a full itinerary, so it's going to be lots of different events like a concert, also like a comedy show, art, museums, a whole lot of things that are going to be done over the weekend. So I'm actually packing and getting ready for that. And that will be, you know, I'm going to take you guys along with me, let you guys see what it's giving. I'm really excited and I'm really, really grateful. I know that I haven't really gotten to like kind of just chit chat with you guys. But I did want to take a moment just to talk to you guys because as a content creator, it's like, I personally feel like I sometimes have no idea what I'm doing. I live in Connecticut and I don't see like the large community of content creators, like some places like Atlanta, for example. So it's kind of just like, I'm sitting here winging it and trying to figure out things on my own. I also have a family. I also have a career. So it's a lot. But to have been, you know, selected to go on this trip for the weekend, it means a lot to me. It means that, you know, I need to just keep doing what I'm doing, keep getting on my Zoom, doing my thing. And of course, I'm going to take you guys along with me. But if you watch to the end, drop me a black heart emoji down in the comments. Let me know that you watched all the way. Also, make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell so you know when I post a new video. Also, all of the outfits that I wore in this video, I will have some pictures, you know, on the screen. But if you want to see them, you know, and see what I post on the daily, then you definitely want to follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Lemon8. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. And stay blessed. Stay beautiful. Bye.